It's the perfect wave. Perfectly regular, the same every time, because these waves weren't made by Mother Nature. Here at the Wave House Artificial Surf Pool in San Diego, it's the future of surfing, complete with a snack bar, chlorine, and a deckside hot tub. I came here one day and it changed my life, you know. The only time I see the beach is from right here. Surf entrepreneurs at this conference in Laguna Beach are working on the technology to provide even more perfect waves at pools across the world for the right price. Price. For a real legitimate surf pool, 15 to 25 million. The surf industry has been in a slump for several years. Lochtefeld says wave parks could open new markets. You're going to get the concrete, you're going to get just these machine type waves, and you're going to get you know, people selling popcorn and peanuts and just like what you see at the ballpark. In Huntington Beach, there are those who will always hear the call of the ocean. I don't know if the water parks are going to be able to have that feel that the salt water gives you, that euphoria you get from just being in the salt water. But for every soul surfer, there will be someone like Samantha Aker, who's happy to pay for perfect waves. I think it's been like a year and a half since I've surfed, so I just stopped doing it all together and this is just so much more fun. It's definitely worth it. It's like cheaper than crack. <laughs> you cannot believe in my travels around the world, this concept of America and the freedom that America has and this, how surfing embodies that freedom, it's so much stronger internationally. It's amazing. Very, very much in demand. Then there are the many more potential surfers in the landlocked Midwest, or maybe China, or the United Arab Emirates. Raquel Maria Dillon, The Associated Press, Laguna Beach, California.